Today I'm doing a DIY tutorial on an engagement basket. One of my best friends got engaged last year, however, she was super busy during that time and I was busy at the beginning of this year. So we finally made time to hang out and do a double date and this is what I'm going to give her. Now I'm going to show you guys how I usually set up an engagement gift basket. So I'm going to start off with this basket that I got from Michaels. She loves the color yellow. However, I'm going to incorporate gold as the main theme here but I'm also going to add yellow accents to this gift basket. Do you see how it's shimmering in gold outlines for the flowers here? So cute. I'm going to be putting the cap underneath so that way it gives it a little of the gold accent here. With gift baskets, I like to add a bit of bubble wrappers as cushion on the bottom. And it should look like this. Don't worry about this because I'll be hiding it with the wood excelsior. Next step, I'm going to be adding this. So a lot of people call this material either wood paper straws, but then I found the actual term and it's actually called wood excelsior. And a lot of people use this for packaging, gift baskets, or basically anything arts and crafts. Then I'm going to spread it out. Next, I'll be adding magazines onto the basket. With wedding magazines, this serves as like an inspiration for brides to like look at wedding dresses, venues, decor, or anything that's wedding related. So it's actually a good idea to give magazines to bride-to-be's. Next, I'll be adding Ferrero chocolates. Then I'll be adding a bottle of sparkling wine and I really like the design that has gold accents which is perfect for this gift basket theme by the way. Next I'll be adding champagne glasses. So I was looking for gold accents I can put inside of the champagne glasses. Couldn't find anything. So I decided to use these gold ribbons instead and it works. Next, I'll be adding his and her vows. That way my best friend can write her vows here. And her husband-to-be is going to write his vows in his booklet. And this brand that I got it from is Moleskine. Next, I'll be adding a ring plate, Mr. on the left side and Mrs. on the right side. And this brand is Kate Aspen. Next, I'll be adding a mango Mai Tai from Bud Light. And the reason why I chose this is because it has a yellow accent on it. <laughs> I really like the design, as you can see here. Lastly, I'll be decorating with yellow tissue paper and obviously a gold ribbon to match up with the entire theme. And I can't wait to show you guys the final results. I'm gonna scrunch this up. I'm gonna fluff up the ribbon. Typically, I would use a hot gun glue to glue the ribbons onto the basket. But just in case, if she wants to keep this basket and use it for something else, using tape will be easier for her to remove, to be honest. So that is an option. I'm just going to be taping the magazine as so. That way, it'll stick and not like move around too much. And this is the final results, guys. This literally took me about 10 minutes to set up. It wasn't difficult. I definitely had fun creating this engagement gift basket, and I can't wait to show my best friend this later on. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!